Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. My name is Clara and in today's video I have a farmhouse Dollar Tree DIY project for you guys. And this project is going to be just a little bit more advanced than the ones I have made in the past. And I am going to be making a white enamel two-tiered stand. So let's get started. And these are going to be the materials we're going to be using for this project. You're going to want one of these which is a picture hanging kit and from this we're going to be using the small nails. A small saw. I did purchase this at the Dollar Tree. I'm going to be using a rubber mallet, but if you have a hammer, you can use that. A drill, and then a 7 8 hole saw. Some white spray paint. E6000. Black paint. A glass candle jar a cake pan, and a pie pan. Yeah. And the last thing you're gonna need is one of these dust pans, but we're only gonna be using the handle part of it. And you can also use one of these floral foams. So now that we made our hole and spray painted our pie and cake pans, this is what they look like. And this is how the glass candle holder looks like after it's been spray painted. Now with the dust pan, we're gonna remove the bottom. Now using the little saw, I'm going to take about 11 inches off the bottom of the handle here. And I'm just gonna be turning while I'm sawing. And then your handle should easily just snap off. So you won't need the bottom part anymore. And this is what the handle is going to look like. Now this is going to be at the very top. And this is going to be the bottom. So now I'm going to be using a rubber band to measure where I want my tray to sit. So now I put my rubber band where I want my tray to sit and now with my black sharpie I'm going to make a line tracing my rubber band. This is just going to help guide where you're going to place your nails. And now using the small nails that come in the kit we are going to put four like to make a cross and that's just going to hold and place your cake stand. So that's how the first nail looks and you want to make sure that it's as straight as possible. And now we're going to put one, two, and three. So now that we've made our four holes, now we're going to insert the cake pan. And 
And now we're going to insert our nails back into where we made the holes. So this is what the first cake stand looks like. And this is what the back should look like. Next, we're gonna grab our glass candle holder. So now that we put our floral foam into the bottom of our candle holder, we're going to insert. And now using our E6000, we're going to put some around the floral foam. Now I'm gonna grab some E6000 and put some hot and put some glue on the ins inside of the floral foam. So now what you want to do is you want to make sure that everything is as straight as possible. And let the glue dry. And let the, and let your glue dry. So now I'm just gonna be adding some E6000 to these parts right here just to give it a little bit more support. And you want just a small, thin layer. And now with our shower curtain ring, what you wanna do is you wanna just go ahead and put it in the middle of the handle here. So it looks like that. And if you like, you can go ahead and paint it black or you can go ahead and just leave it white. And now using our black acrylic paint, I'm just gonna go ahead and put the black around the trim just to give it that enamel look. All right, so this is the final look to our two-tier stand. 